Today we're taking apart one of the most famous casino games ever made and explaining the real odds behind every single roulette bet. And by the end, you'll understand why the wheel looks so innocent, but the math behind it is far from friendly. Let's begin with the basics. American Roulette has 38 pockets, the numbers 1 through 36, plus the green zero and the green double zero. Those two green pockets are tiny, but they control almost everything that happens in the game. Every win, every loss, and every so-called strategy quietly depends on them. If you remove the zero and double zero, the entire game would flip from favoring the casino to favoring the player. That's why they're there. Now picture the wheel spinning and the ball bouncing around. Every number at the instant the ball drops has exactly the same chance of being hit. No number is due, no number is hot, no number owes anybody anything. With 38 pockets on the wheel, the probability of hitting any single number is 1 out of 38. That's about 2.6%, and that brings us to the most direct bet in roulette, the straight-up bet, where you bet on one exact number. The payout for this is 35 to 1. That sounds generous until you compare it to your actual odds. If the payout was 37 to 1, it would be fair. But it isn't. That difference is where the casino makes money. If you bet on two numbers at once, called a split bet, your chances double to 2 out of 38, but the payout shifts to 17 to 1. Again, sounds big, but it's not quite big enough to match the real odds. That gap is the casino edge, and the same pattern happens again and again. A three-number bet has a 7.89% chance of winning, a four-number bet has a 10.53% chance. A six-number bet sits at about 15.8%. But no matter which of these inside bets you choose, the house edge stays almost perfectly the same. It's 5.26%. That means for every $100 bet over time, the casino expects to keep a little over $5. Not right away, not every spin, but across thousands of spins, the math wins. Now let's move to the outside bets the ones that look safer and more predictable because they cover much larger portions of the wheel. 